Alright, hey there Proxians, this is Prox right here, and guys, welcome back to another episode of the Paper Mario and the Origami King. Now guys, if you did miss out in the last episode, we actually went and taking care of the Paper Mistake Buzzy Beetle, and also taking care of the Scissors Boss, which that was our main objective here inside the Bowser's Castle. We rescued out Bowser, and now we're just going to be trying to make our way on over to the Supply Closet to see what is going to be uh, lying our, our way over with Bowser, because I believe he is going to be our last of the partners here in Origami King, which that kind of sucks, but unfortunately, Kemic has been a blast, and I really liked enjoying playing around with Kemic as well, and uh, him just blasting all the enemies around was just so much fun, but having Bowser is going to be pretty nice, so I can't wait till we get to uh, be partnered up with Bowser and take on some enemies with him. Now, just to let you guys know that uh, we're just going to do a little bit of some of the storyline here, and I'm pretty certain we should be able to now uh, be able to do some other free roaming after once this is over. And then we could be able to go and head back to some of the other previous areas. Let's try to get all the 100%ing that I would like to do. Because if we actually go and check back in our map section for right now, we're kind of like not really... We haven't really 100% through everything, so we kind of actually want to make sure that we kind of get everything done and finished with so then we can uh, uh, worry about that. So, I think Sacred Spa may probably be our number one area to actually go and try to 100% through everything out first, and then we'll start heading back to like Toe Town and some other places like that. Uh, I just figured out where the one up mushrooms are going to be. Uh, they're actually located at Toe Town. Once you actually collected your very first uh, one up mushroom, they should be activated over at Toe Town. And you could go and purchase out uh, them. Uh, for whatever you want but you can only have only one of the one-up mushrooms you cannot have two or three or whatnot uh, you can only just only have one mushroom which that kind of sucks but it doesn't matter uh, now also too uh, hope you guys are having yourself a good uh, Saturday I believe you guys should be able to see this on Saturday of course so uh, stay tuned for that also we also got ourselves another pearl wedlock happening our way so just only a few more episodes guys and then we can do ourselves with the Pokemon white 2 randomizer version 2 which I am super happy about doing and then we could go and do the nightmare moon which I'm also gonna be really excited about so nightmare moon I I cannot wait until I actually try that out it's basically like playing Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon but this one has a little bit of a different storyline to it it's pretty neat and uh, I can't wait till I try it out and show it off to you guys it's gonna be really fun now, uh, coming down this way, you can actually go and talk to some of the other uh, people that are still here. You got to talk to a hammer bro out here, and uh, he says that you did it. You defeated the scissors. Now, they're going to be writing a book and a movie, but everyone was going to hate me. <laughs> because, of course, all of Bowser's minions really hates, uh, hates the Mario. Because we've been stomping on their heads for plenty of, of years. Uh, so, Lord of Bowser asked me to relay a short message. So, hurry up and get to the supply closet. You're letting a guy who's walking with his face walk faster than you. So, yes, that does mean we do have to head on over to the supply closet because that is where we're going to be heading on over. Now, you guys may probably remember this door, but it was on the uh, far uh, left side. And we haven't really fully explored the far left side yet because I believe this door was actually locked during our time uh, when we were with Kemic. And the only thing that we could actually only do was head on over down to the far right side. So, let's go ahead and check out what this one is all about. So, there's a shy guy here. So, let's see what he has to say. Lord Bowser, waits for you. All right. So, where is Lord Bowser and all this? He said he's going to be in here. Oh, there he is. He's just chilling there. So, oh, Mario, welcome. This is a merely a supply closet. But wait until you see what is on the other side of that door. So, normally I won't allow you inside these confidential areas, of course. But that's why I had the security system installed, so no one gets in unless I say so. So to unlock the door, you have to uh, do something with those pillars. It definitely evolves with those pillars. So do something with those pillars and hurry up with it. Oh, well, thanks a lot for the help there, Bowser. I know that you kind of hate us, but uh, that was a, a really uh, nice thing to do. But really, this puzzle is not all that too difficult anyways, because all you have to do is just kind of hit this puzzle here. And then you just kind of move yourself into a line, I think. Because I'm pretty certain if you just line up all the other different uh, beetles together, you should be fine. And I think the door should open up. It's really not that hard of a puzzle. I don't really think so. So then you just kind of line up this one here. And it's... Eh, come on. Come on. Yeah, there you go. And just spin around once more. And then I think all we have to do now is just kind of tilt this all the way over to the end. And there we go. We got the door to open. Not that too bad of a puzzle. Ah, oh, I should have known uh, that you figured it out. Time to get a refund from my security guy. Anyway, follow me. Yes, let's go. 
Oh man, there's a lot of bullet bills here. Wow, it seems like their arsenal is already like uh, already set, man, for Ollie. <laughs> but I have to say, I really like the uh, the final battle with Ollie because uh, the, the different three phases I really kind of enjoy about that. So wow, this is uh, it's. What is this? It's really something. What what is it we're looking at? Patience, Origami. Now, Mario, I got one more job for you. Come. So what is this, man? Oh, wow, we got some uh, little extra stuff out here. So I guess this is how we're going to be able to get our 100%, it looks like. So there we go. Got ourselves another chest out here. Got ourselves the cutout soldiers. Nice. So that's what they're called. They're called cutout soldiers. Interesting. So I guess we're still missing out on a few more things, aren't we? We got 75 and 71, so we're missing out on one more collectible and one more chest out here. So push uh, the button on the left and all of our problems will be solved. So do it. Okay, so I guess we'll just check this button out here. So cut engines. So do I just have to check this button? Secret weapon. Okay. What do I do? Do I just hit it or something? Oh, God. What did I do? What is this, man? Is, this is like some sort of like, uh, I think it's an airship, isn't it? It is an airship. Oh, man. This is going to be our awesome ride to Ollie's place. But should we really go over to Ollie's place? Because, like, hopefully, hopefully they don't really, like, force us to literally go to Ollie's place. Because I would actually kind of want to just 100% mostly the areas. So it's really nice. And you say that this thing flies. Oh, there's Bowser Jr. Uh, what do you think, Mario? We probably would have used this against you. But maybe we still will. So don't look around too much when you're on board. Oh. Oh, are you the uh, grass keeper on the airship, too? What? No, this is a magic brew. It's not for sweeping. Although I do already see a few dusty areas that could use some attention, so excuse me. <laughs> I like Kemic. Checking in for duty, ma'am. Whoa, Bobby, is that you? How? No, 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 there's too many Bobbies. Oh, what's happening? I'm seeing things. Uh, there are so many Bobbies. <laughs> uh, but I think Bobby was gone after he saved my life with that ka big kaboom. Uh, do you have me confused with another bob -omb? It's okay. It happens all the time. Uh, we do our jobs, and when we're done, we're always another bob -omb. So they're so there to take our place. Any of us can hope for this is to make an impact, ma'am. I suppose if you say so. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to think too hard about this. It's just nice to see you again, Bobby. And thank you. All right. And all the bob -ombs are coming on board as well. All aboard. We store Pizza's Castle at 5. Oh, man. All right, so you two do whatever you need to do to prepare yourselves. I told some, uh, 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 what the heck? Some anesthesia, uh, oh, anesthesia, uh, oh, anesthesia medicine may be in order. Oh, my God. Uh, I didn't know what the word was actually saying right there. But uh, let's just go and quickly save. So you guys are going to get taken off in five minutes. So I'm pretty certain that if we actually do uh, head on over into Bowser's castle... Uh, or, or not Bowser's Castle, into Pizza's Castle, uh, I think we're going to be locked in. So I think what I'm going to probably do is kind of exit out of this area for right now, if I can, if there's a way that I can't exit out. Oh, no. Don't tell me that I can't exit out of here, dude. Oh, man. Well, hopefully there's a pipe or something that I could actually exit out of here. Oh, man. Okay, well, I guess I'm ready. I'm all good to go. Ready to go? Yes. No, I don't think I can do my 100%ing. All right, l listen up, everyone. Start the engines. All right, here we go. Off to Ollie's castle. Slash Peach's castle. I hope we can rescue Peach and not make her uh, into origami and just try to turn her into paper. Here we go. Oh, wow, it actually saved us for us here anyway, so we're all good. Wow, that's one big, huge airship, dude. Wow, uh, here we go. Aim directly into the, uh, and punch it. Aw, oh, man, I didn't get to read the whole entire text. It went way too fast. Ah, uh, there, there's Kevin, dude. 
I love this music in Origami K. Really nice music. Good OST, good storyline. I wish they made the bosses a little bit more harder. Like, like for some of the easier bosses. But, it's alright. I'm glad that you like it. They told me it was the most powerful and least efficient vehicle ever produced. I showed that you were around more, but we're almost there. Can uh, this bad boy uh, move or what? Lord Bowser, enemies spotted right ahead. Did we actually make it here? Oh, no, not just yet. Got some uh, airplanes out here, paper airplanes. So what do you think? Those are decorative cannons we got here. Load them up and open fire. Oh, man, here comes up the spikes. They're basically going to become their cannons, I guess. Oh, man, here they go. They're going to be dropping in. Oh, this is actually pretty cool. But a little bit scary. Hopefully it doesn't damage up the ship, though. Nice job, Kemic. Disintegrate some of those. We still have to be careful on our toes. There could still be more. That one was easy. Didn't even scratch the paint. My lord, there are more of them. Oh, no. Is this what we actually do have to go in and try to fight these on our own as well? I don't know what to quit, do they? Uh, Mario, want to make yourself useful for once? Follow me. What are we going to be able to do? Are we going to get ourselves our own cannon to shoot at them? <laughs> oh my goodness. You're going to fire the big gun and don't mess it up. Now there are two ways to do this. Use your motion controls or use the left stick. Um, I'll use the left stick. So. That should be not too bad. So alright, get ready. Okay, here we go. So here's how it works. Move the L to aim and press uh, A to blast your enemies. It's that simple. So don't even think about uh, accessing the menu right now because you've got a cannon to fire. So don't mess this up. Line them up. Alright. Here we go. So we got a few coming. Nice. Here we go. Destroy up some of these guys. So it looks like we have, again, like five life, just like before uh, when we were heading into that uh, Eddy River before. Whoa. Okay, these guys are going everywhere. Okay, we take care of the big guy. Nice. Now these guys are going a little bit too fast for us. Well, watch out for Kemic. Eh. Oh, God, Kemic. Hey, don't shoot me. We well, were in my way, dude. There we go. We're taking care of them. Hey, nice guys. That's an extra heart if we ever do need them. And I guess we're in a checkpoint, it looks like, because it seems like it's just we got ourselves a heart right now. One after another. Hey, what's that? Oh, man, it's the big ship. We got the Star Destroyer. <laughs> I don't know. This feels kind of like Star Wars, dude. Like, like, forced unleash a little bit. Oh, no. Oh, come here, dude. Get these big guys out of here. Nice. So don't worry about your ammo, it seems like, because like we're kind of have like infinite uh, ammo right now. Save me! What? Where are you? Oh, here we go. Uh, get the other one. There you go. Ah, there. That takes care of those guys on that side. This is really neat. This is kind of unique in the Paper Mario games. Whoa! I thought I was done for it. Thanks for saving my shell. No problem. Hey, you actually healed us up as well, too. Ain't coming more of them. Oh, man. They're dropping everywhere. Here, take those. Take this. Ugh. You annoy paper airplanes. Oh, God. I guess there was no extra heart there. I'll oh, come here, you. Uh, don't shoot me. Uh, that that shit was going a little bit too fast. Ouch. 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 Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, we're kind of in the danger zone right now. Oh, come on. 
Oh god. Ugh. I'm only down to like one more life. Yes, okay, I'm back up to five. Oh, thank god. I thought it was gonna be game over for sure. So where's the big ship? Is that it? Yeah, there it is. That is one big chef. How many hits is this guy going to take? Probably five hits, probably. Just like how much uh, we have right now with the hearts. Alright, let's go. Let's try to knock out one of his wings out here, hopefully. Oh, man. Okay, so it looks like it doesn't really get hit anymore. Okay, so you guys are coming everywhere. Wow, it doesn't even hit at all. It doesn't even phase him. So it looks like we have to take care of his minions out here first. There you go. That should do it. Alright, so it looks like we can fire at him a little bit more. I think he's going down. I think it's going down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calm down with all this, dude. There we go. Kind of fire him a little bit more, and I think he should be going down, hopefully. Come on. He's... Eh. Come on. All of his wings are down. He should be falling. I think it's done. I think it's done for him. Yeah, he's gone. Is it destroyed? Crushed it. Ah. Uh, whoa. Whoa. What's going on? Okay. I, I'm pretty sure that if we didn't really kill that, I think it would probably crush us, and I think we would have got a game over. That airship did most of the, uh, most of it just say, Come now, Mario. For more than adequately. Okay. Looks like we're finished here for now. So nice work, Mario. You are our hero, and that explosion those bobbies did was amazing, too. Yes, yes. Let's not get carried away. The airship really did all of the heavy lifting. Yep. So Beast's castle is in sight. Begin the final approach. And there it is. Wow. I remember back in episode one, that was the very first place that we were actually trying to make our way to. Oh no, here we go. Oh, that's Ollie's ship. Now that ship actually kind of looks like the Star Destroyer a little bit. Just vaguely looks like it. Oh, man. Uh, we're crash landing, dude. Ouch. Well, hopefully everyone's going to be all right. We're in a hot foot crater. Well, after all of that, another crash landing. I mean, our first crash landing is... Bowser's not even here. Oh, man. Dad's not going to be happy about the airstrap. His insurance premiums are already so high. And where are we anyways? Yeah, I, I guess this insurance would be pretty high because of all the damaging that we have done throughout the years with all of his different, like, aircrafts and everything that we've been causing. The world's on fire. No, no, no. I think we landed in a, in a volcano. Actually, I believe that we're just a simpler explanation. We must have just Mrs. Peach's castle and crashed into a volcano instead. Yeah, I, was, I thought so. Hey, up there. It's me. Never mind the airship. You know, it's build another one. Just get up here. I got something to show you. Dad, you're okay. I was worried that you got folded up uh, even smaller or something. We'll be right there. Blast, we lost my magic broom and young master's clown car and all into confusion. Seems that we'll have to proceed on foot. So here we go. We're all saved up and I think we're ready to go. And I guess I'm going to call this a part here instead. So it seems like, unfortunately, guys, that I don't think I'm going to be able to do any type of 100 percenting at all. Uh, I don't know. Hopefully there's going to be a warp pipe or something that can take us uh, back over to Toe Town at some point, which I think we may probably will. It's just that we have to wait until we actually reach on over to Peach's Castle instead because I would like to go and pick up a uh, another 1-Up Mushroom at some point if I can. Uh, but anyways, uh, don't forget to leave a comment, like, also subscribe, and we'll uh, start heading on into uh, or start basically exploring throughout here in Hotfoot uh, Crater. So I'll see you guys then, and peace.